doing this uh, as part of uh, the Islamic Circle of North America, uh, you know, belonging to Muslims in the New York area. And uh, we want to we want to show that you know Muslims care for their neighbors, care for their community. The mission that Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala gave to Muhammad the Prophet was that we are here to be the example for all of humankind because that's what he was. And if we follow that, I think our mission is easy. My weakness uh, are children, and uh, of course, my children are my weakness, and uh, and they are my strength as well. If I provide them right things on right time when they need it, uh, especially when they are going to school, I like to have them their uniform. I like to have them their school bags, school supplies, and of course, I go to Staples, Walmart to find out all of this. But at the same time, the things which is struck on my mind is what about those? who can even travel uh, to Walmart, who can even buy that stuff for their children. But they have children, and they are, their children are their weakness too, and their children are their strength too. So they need to, they need to get something so they can hand over to their children. They can see the smile on their children's face as I love to see my children smiling or laughing when they got what they need to get. <laughs> We're about to start the bagging process, inshallah. So, um, yeah, we're just getting ready. We had some problems yesterday. We found out that our shipment uh, was delayed, so some of the stuff has not come in and it will not be in uh, by this bagging process. So we're going to have to do a, a, little, a little bit of double work, um, but inshallah we'll get through it. Uh, we're gonna bag whatever we have right now and uh, bag the rest uh, later. Right now, those, those guys over there, they're, doing, um, they're making all the boxes that we have. Uh, those boxes are gonna carry all of the, the, the made uh, bags, school bags that we have with the supplies so that we can ship them out um, effectively. Uh, these guys are setting up the bagging process. Um, Alhamdulillah, this year we have a different approach to bagging uh, where we're going to be passing the bags instead of volunteers running with the bags. Um, and so yeah, this is setting it up. And we have sisters over there, they're just counting the inventory. We need to, uh, we have bags uh, of all different types of colors including pink. So we need to make sure it's dis we distribute them properly so that we don't give uh, one chapter pink and the other chapter blue. We want to give them an equal amount of everything, inshallah. So what, what's going to happen is these guys are unboxing over here. So they're going to unbox, they're going to unbag, and they're going to unzip. And they're going to put those unzip and unbag ones here. We're going to take them to put, put the books in there, the two notebooks. So pass that uh, bag down over there. Two pencils, one way to go here, you pass it down over there. Markers get placed over there. Comes over here, it gets zipped up and put in this box. Then when, we, when we're done with the box, we put how, how many are in the box, pack it up and put it back in there. And that's how do the same thing? Same thing, so we have two sets going. So inshallah, it should be done faster. Rehan, all right. I want you to go with Hamza. Pick up the rest of the paper. Okay. Wrong. Okay. You know where it is in my paint, right? Yeah. I know. Saman, why? Can we take your car? Yeah. We're a little short on the notebooks. Probably we go to White Plains. They all take the one and a half hour. So uh, what's going on is, uh, let me hold on. Let me get this straight. So there's markers and there's highlighters, and we mixed up the markers and the highlighters. So we, we were supposed to put five markers in each each uh, bag and one highlighter. But we thought the highlighters were the markers, we started putting five highlighters in each bag. So uh, we're, we're gonna adjust the math and we're gonna start putting one highlighter. We're gonna run out of highlighters. So we're thinking of getting more. Yeah, it sucks. <laughs> but I, I will have you know that the highlighters look like markers. <laughs> this is an innocent mistake.
Ja. Poor family. I, I, I have the mask. And every year when I see him, I, I go, I give him back, 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 back. This year, I see him, mashallah, alhamdulillah. Inshallah, every year. Alhamdulillah. Inshallah, inshallah. Alhamdulillah. Allah love us, Allah. Alhamdulillah. Allahumma laka alhamdu anta Allahu la ilaha illa anta alimu al-ghaybi wa al-shahada anta ar-rahman ar-rahim la ilaha illa anta al-malik al-quddus al-salam al-mu'min al-muhaymin al-aziz al-jabbar al-mutakabbir subhanallah amma yushirikun la ilaha إلا أنت الخالق البارئ المصور لك الأسماء الحسنى يسبح لك ما في السماوات وما في الأرض وأنت العزيز الحكيم is the lowest income community in USA and the poverty line is the lowest poverty line in the whole USA so we also alhamdulillah find out a community in Bronx as well to where we can uh, distribute these bags basically what we are trying to do is to get to them and give them the bags and the supplies in their hands so we can see child smile to his parents and us and that's the biggest goal we should get after doing this. So it's, it's kind of hectic. <laughs> We're running very, very late. We have 30 minutes to uh, get the stuff. And the other thing is that uh, he doesn't have a van to lend us, so we need to get everything in here, inshallah. Aslam, how are you? I met you, I mean, I talked to you yes, before, right? Yes, now, yes, 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 yes. Uh, we have a little dilemma. Uh, can ask him if you can stay here and set up. Can There's you stay nothing here? No, there is. Uh, do we have more volunteers? have a right? Easels, okay. Uh, we have a whole bunch of these posters. We want to put some on, on this side because we want to show that there's a, a lane, a line. So since we don't have anything on this side, we'll put the easels and the posters on this side, and then we'll hang the posters on the wall over here. I think that this is this is a tightening mechanism. It has been tightened. It's it's making me look bad. <laughs> but I'll stop it. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> Watch. This is what he's gonna show. He's gonna show all of it. All like ten minutes of. You can't pull out the wow, this thing is really stuck. No, Alright, I give up. I think I know what's going on, but I can't uh -oh. fix it. We're going to set up the tent. The pin on this thing is missing and I need to move this up. I think it dropped here somewhere. It's just a ring, yeah. I, I need it though so I can pull it up. Oh man, I'm going to break it. I did break it. Uh oh, my wife's not going to be happy. This back to school giveaway is costing me a fortune. <laughs> Muna here, I broke your pen, but I fixed it. I think. You made it smaller, how? <laughs> <laughs> I put it in more. What if you take that table and put it over here so that as they and come in, person because over? the line's gonna be a little bit slow, right? right so so on the way, on. they can just sign and fill out the information without slowing down the line. We need to start with. One second, let me see. Okay, let go. This time, there aren't as many people, mm -hmm. but this might end up being being really good for us because uh, it gives us time to really set up and there isn't as much of a rush. Okay. And a lot of times when there's a lot of people, you have to worry about all the security issues. People getting hurt, people cutting lines, whatever. In this case, it's as they come, you're giving it. Uh -huh. It works out much more smoother. But it doesn't look as good because you don't see a crowd. Right. But you get to serve everyone who comes. That's good. That's good. For now, there's, there's more than this is Because right now, the sisters, the Muslim sisters, they're cooking now since right now. Now that I've seen all these brothers, all these sisters are lining up over there now, yeah. 
and our Muslim yeah, sisters are going to be left out. Inshallah, we should have enough. Yeah, but because these people we have been invited from 11 yeah. to 1 p.m. They're like we have at flyers, we give out 1,000 even to you guys. So you yes. can't let them. You can't. No, you can't for them, we, yeah. Inshallah, you know, we, yeah, inshallah. we give them whatever Allah yeah. Subhanahu wa Taala predestined for them. Um, what I'm worrying about, the other Muslim sisters Muslim. now, they're going to be left out. because. And there's been some miscommunication with some of the community, it seems. Uh, but when we met with them, we said uh, this program is going to be from 11 to 1 p.m. They have this festival, which is supposed to be from 9 to uh, 8 p.m. or so. so but I, don't, I guess their program has not started yet, but our program was scheduled to 11 to 1. There's only one person from the Muslim here who's representing him. They're saying that uh, there's more people coming in at 3 p.m. So he's scared that we won't have enough uh, supplies to give to the Muslims in the local community. We're going to show up a little later, inshallah. But inshallah, I think uh, we'll have enough. I wish that the whole community was here to help us out and take part um, more so. so. We gotta begin, inshallah. So what can we do? Which one do you want this one? Yeah. This one here? Right. What's your phone number, sir? Yeah. Oh, it's, oh, it's okay. You don't need the... Or email or something. The main, yeah, the main thing is the, the signature and the name. Yeah. Uh, he's one of the board members, Brother Amir. Great, great brother, Master. He's been here in the community a lot. Uh, long time. Long time. Before the mosque was here, I was here. <laughs> <laughs> the mosque let me... Okay, come on, let's go, guys. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff which happens here. This is just one one part of it. Oh, okay. This is gonna be there until like I think four or five o'clock. They have this every year. They block off the street. What they used to have was they used to have all these different activities that the funding used to come from the city. So the kids had all these things to play with and stuff like that. This year they cut back all those things. We don't see in anything here. But the kids are still here, they're still having fun. Maybe we should have uh, had one sheet in Spanish. Oh yeah, that's good. In case good. they don't know English. From last year's experience, I if we did good marketing, in, inshallah it's up to Allah too, right? But um, I, I think it, it should have been all the way down. All the way down. All the way down, like the next block. Blocks. Exactly. That's true, that's true. Because uh, last year it was like it was like whole auditorium. And that was in the Bronx. I mean, I was in Yonkers. Yonkers. This is in the Bronx, South Bronx. And we know this, this area is needy. There's something wrong. There was something we didn't do. A little bit of in the part of marketing. Yeah. Get online? Go over here. So go, go this, way. This, way, this way. This way. This way. People aren't used to being online. They shouldn't just run up. There should be a line. Guys, let's make a line. You, you have to... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Right. So let me ask you a question. This is a hasty little boy. I can't go with him. That's your choice. Okay. Can I come? I don't know. Because you're already touching and pushing it. Can I email? Can I email? Can I email? Can I email for the family? <laughs> wow. Everybody wants to put their own email. Okay, what is this here? This is the first How many children in your name? How many children are in your name? Harder. 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 Of course, I'm in a salon. Wow. What's in happy? That's hard. We're good, guys. Hey, 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 guys. So he's, he says he have another batch in the car. We do have another, not as many, but yeah. yeah so, but so. Yeah, there's a way. I don't know if you guys are gonna be around it, but if that thing here, if you guys are gonna be leaving at one o'clock or two o'clock, then I want those things put back there, and I will be in charge of it just to read into the kids that comes to this level. Okay. Let me talk to a couple of them and, and see what they say. If they stick around till then, that will yeah. be good. Um. Because trust me, come four or five, this whole entire block will be full of people. Yeah. That's what I was expecting. <laughs> yeah, well, it's getting kind of a little bit early right now. Yeah. Some of them are still in their sleep. Okay. But inshallah, you know. Alright. Okay. Basically, the idea is after we're done over here, close we close down. And then at 2 p.m., we're going to start again. Yeah. And then we go over where we have And we go and get the other stuff on the other part. And put that, it here. That's how yeah. yeah. okay. Inshallah, that's good. Cool. For that, we demand hot dogs. Oh, hot, halal hot dogs. <laughs> All those are halal hot dogs here. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Everybody is, is more than welcome to go over there. It's free. Every yeah. afternoon. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> we have, you know. And a massage. <laughs> and a massage. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> So yeah, I think that, that sounds good. Yeah, yeah. I'll let it be, you know, because yeah. I will call the other masters, you know, let them come in here around two. They have to be here around two. So, so we have a little bit less than 200 bags left, like in the front. So okay. then, so, inshallah, whatever we can give, we'll get the first 200, the first 150 that comes in, and we'll give it to we'll give it, and then we're, we're and then we're done. So, so, good. Yeah, the Imam is the Imam. This mosque uh, is a long time, 28 years. So when we came for this project, he gladly agreed it and he gave us support and all the volunteers the local mosque is provided by him. It's a very beautiful day for you all and for us. And we thank you all for the help that you have given us here today. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you all and help you all in this life and the next life to come. Well, we uh, thank the local mosque for playing such a major role in uh, community relations. I mean, having this type of event for the back to school, programs here where local families come and pick up a backpack stocked with goodies for their children. It's a wonderful thing and this type of partnership that you see between the mosque and the local community is what it's all about. We're doing this um, as part of uh, the Islamic Circle of North America, uh, which is an organization, uh, you know, belonging to Muslims in the New York area. We want to show that you know Muslims care for their neighbors, care for their community, and this is just a small effort that we're trying to pitch in and just do what we can. Let's try to organize them by type. There's two different kind of bags. There's a real school bag and there's a string bag. And then maybe we can separate them by color too. Hey guys, one of the most important things that we have to do is crowd control. So as people are coming in, we have to make sure they kind of stay in line, see orderly, no one cuts line. So I need at least two guys out there and towards the outside also because traffic is starting to get back up. We need a cutoff time, okay? Because we're going to people 11 o'clock. Got the people waiting. Yeah. We shouldn't do that, man. Yeah, we shouldn't do that. Yeah. yeah. We shouldn't do that, man. No, we're waiting for Steve Devi, he's the Suffolk County Executive. Okay. Um, it'll be good to, we were asking him to give out the first bag, but uh, unfortunately he's not here yet, and we have a lot of people waiting. So we're going to begin around 11.15. If he's not here, we have to start, because it also becomes a security hazard, uh, because people are waiting on the, um, on the sidewalk. And uh, also, we, we don't want people to wait as long as well, because they've been waiting for some time. All right, everybody. Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you. Which means Thank peace you. be upon you. We welcome you all. Thank you for your patience. Come around slowly. Everybody should be receiving a, a book bags for all of their children. Uh, when you come down, I want you to come down and go up to the sign-up sheet. We need everyone to put your name, your initials, your signature, and the number of children that you have on the sign-up sheet. This helps us in future projects because we want to show that we had this many people, this many children, so we can better serve you next year and the years to come, uh, God willing. I want you to go one family at a time. No, your, na your name is not on That's my name. That's my name. That's my name. My name. I got it first. No, I got it first. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're both on one. Mommy! Is that okay? Mommy! Yeah? Mommy! Cool. Find the first one. <laughs> yeah, what happened? Is it my number one? Wait, wait. <laughs> How far do you live away from here? Like, what, two blocks? Oh, okay. One block. How did you find out about the event? The library they give away. Oh, okay. Great. Is that camera on? Yes, he's doing a documentary on this whole project. We actually have um, six others that we're doing. Last week we did it in the Bronx. Uh, tomorrow yeah. we're doing one in Staten Island. I used to and live in the Bronx. Oh yeah, we're in the Bronx. I used to live in the Bronx. <laughs> oh wait, your name is Omar. Are you sure? My yeah. name is Omar. I used to live in the Bronx. No, 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 no. no it can't be. You're getting uh, this all wrong. Okay? Okay. <laughs> I live in Bronx, and then you come oh, out. What are you doing here? And then you came. Family, just, oh, I can step up next family. All right, come on. Step right here. Wait, 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 w
Yeah. I'm just saying. Uh, yeah. Big Ben started. Uh, I would need your mom. Wait, 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 yeah. Yeah. Uh, just wait. So this is in English? You're gonna take hey, you anything? Yeah. Okay. Okay. You good? Yeah. Well, it's good to see that Obama came in. Made it. Why don't we talk with Mr. King a little bit? You know, why, why, why he's on so extreme? You know, I mean, he's like, you know, know, he doesn't hurt get us. it. He, he it hurt it, us. I, I, I like Peter, but um, you know, I think he's mistaken on this one. You know. Have you guys ever met? I know him, Peter. You know. It would be good for you to meet him because, you know, um, he's got to understand that there's, you know, like in every mm -hmm. every religion, you got your crazies, mm -hmm. and then you have the regular folks who are just doing things like this, nice things. He's got, you know, he's got to see good people like yourself, you know. So uh, that would be good. That would be good. Hi, fellas. Hey, how are you doing? How are you? Good. See what you're doing. How are you? Now, my pleasure. What is the uh, I C N A stand for. It's not Islamic Circle of North America. Oh, okay. They, they've been around for I think over 50 years. They've been helping. Uh, they've been helping Muslims all across America. They've been helping non-Muslims too. Just different causes. Well, obviously, you guys are doing that today. Yeah, <laughs> we're here today. We're trying to help out. Beautiful. That's right, good. It's good to see you guys involved. Yeah, this is a South property. Okay. About an acre, we go all the way around. Here's our plan. Oh, you're going to be building? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We done, we done, uh, we done map it all out. And this is just the, this is the, 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 I want to let you, let you know what we're trying to do here in Wyandotte. Right. We're going to need your help and support. Right. And, we, and we come with a ton of services that we want to offer the community. Right. So right now, what we need now is we're waiting on the town. <laughs> so I'm just we're putting a bug in your ear. Okay. Okay. And what, what do you got, about an acre here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay we're going and, and this is the plot right here? Yeah, right here, right here, right in front. That's where the mosque's going to be. Okay? How, how do people around here? Are they, we, they okay with it? Our neighbors are fantastic. They're fine. They're are they worried about parking or no, anything? No, no, we don't have that problem. No problem. Okay, okay. Okay. We've been here, okay, so far. And so we just haven't heard from the town yet. It's okay. Been, it's been about a year now, okay? So maybe you could, uh, you know. Yeah, I'll put the word in. Absolutely. Thank you. Okay. Let's see where you are. Okay. So right now you're operating out of this? So yeah. small. Yeah, yeah we, we, we operate out of this. You come in, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. While you're here, at least you know. I've been here. You, you got to come all the way in. You, you stop here. This is it's small. This is a small community. This is where we're at. Okay. And this is where we've been doing. This is not adequate. Right. Because like on the E, we can't even have E prayers here. We have to go to Bayshore. Which way is Mecca? I know, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> but uh, now we had a, the, the preliminary plans on the board there just to get people motivated. But mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that's where we're at now, Steve. You know, we've been waiting for the town, so I'm glad you Well, it'd be nice out. that you'll be able to expand, yeah, Absolutely, right? okay. So if you can just put a little word in for You us. have your Friday worships? Absolutely, yeah. How many people you get in here? We read about maybe about uh, 40. Right? And, uh, but it's so small, yeah, we keep it small. Right, 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 right. Until we can build. So everybody's waiting. Yeah, so how many you got? How many you got? Yeah, so we have a whole bunch I haven't counted, but wow. what we do is uh, we take down a number of children that are present. Right. We have the sig signatures. So next year we want to hopefully get some more corporate sponsorships, you know, so we can do it, do more, not just in wine dance, but in other areas in Long Great. Island and all across New York. Wonderful. So, but yeah. All right, fantastic. Good. Good. Keep doing what you're doing. I commend everyone uh, within uh, the Muslim community here who have reached out to the surrounding community to help people from all denominations. It, uh, they're not asking people, oh, what's your race, what's your religion? If you're in need, we're all part of the same community, and the mosque is here to help, and uh, I commend them for it. You represent it well. <laughs> well, experience is very good. We, we never thought, you know, we would get this kind of response. Uh, we were not sure, honestly speaking, about Staten Island. I was thinking it might be 150 people or 200 people, you know, in the beginning, because you don't know the, about the trend of the people. I believe so, it's more than 300 plus. But what we have seen, it's a really blessing, you know. And turnover was excellent, and top of that, you know, about five people took Shahada. I mean, this is really thanks to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I think that's a big lesson for all of us, for all the masjids, mosques, to involve the, the community around them to let them know uh, what they are. 
and I think there were 15 to 20 volunteers and they are very responsible. Girls are also there, some sisters, and they are very happy to volunteer their time and for, for the good cause. You know, if just about 2,000, uh, 2000 plus Islamic centers all over America, if we do the same thing, trust me, there is no way Islam people say, oh, we don't know about that. Let the people know we should involve in the community and you will see the response, you know. People were so cooperative, everybody was happy. And everybody was happy. And I think we will be able to make it uh, more organized next time. So this way we can involve other communities also. Um, if you can sign here. Um, so yeah, I mean, this was, uh, I think this was a great experience for everybody here. And, uh, you know, I got to meet a lot of people from different cultures and, you know, interact with them. They were really appreciative of what we did for them. And, you know, they'll be, they were interested in, you know, when we do it again. So, you know, it's uh, definitely an awesome experience. And, uh, you know, I'll definitely be volunteering again for it. Fourth grade, you. What color? Where are you going to? Uh, my name is Ryan. Um, I'm from Florida, Asher, Orlando. I came to visit my aunt. So uh, it's my first weekend here. Um, I've never heard of ICNA. I'm pretty active in Orlando. We have ISNA, we have MSA, we have all, a bunch of other stuff we do over there. But uh, we've never done anything like this about the back to school giveaway. I thought it was very good. Um, it was very good. To, it was mostly for the kids, actually. Usually when we do stuff in Orlando, we, still, we do stuff for the homeless. We do stuff for like people who are in need. But we haven't filled the need of the children yet, I don't think. So to give back for the, mostly for the kids, you know, we supplied them with the books and the the backpacks, I mean, and the papers, pencils. I thought it was really nice. I had a lot of fun. Um, the brothers uh, in the ICNA, they're very, very, very friendly. Um, you know, they made me feel very comfortable, even though it's my first weekend in New York. Um, so, basically, starting from top to bottom, it was a lot of fun. Had a lot of fun. It was a good time. Good to know that it, it drew a lot of people. Um, we had a family convert to Islam. So, stuff we can do like this to help kids, help the community, and then some like these kids, you know, with these backpacks. Look at this. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. Thank you. Everybody have a nice day. Oh, Thank way, you. Way, way, Which way? This way? Okay, exit. Bye, guys. Have a great school year. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>
there'll be Uzbekistani, there'll be Sudani. It's a quite amazing actually. Lucky, let's go mess. Let's go mess. What about the Yankees? <laughs> so I really like the fact that it was a mixed audience, like it wasn't fully like Pakistani, we had Hispanic people and we had black people, so that was really good. And it was nice to see everybody out helping each other and helping the community. It really makes a difference when you speak to the people out here, it changes their perspective. And people were very receptive to conversation, so I think it was important that we had people ushering the line and talking to people because it made them feel more welcome. I got to brush up on my Spanish and I was talking to one of the Spanish neighbors and uh, she was telling me, she was like, I wish I had a Muslim neighbor. And that's exactly what we want people to realize, that a Muslim neighbor is supposed to be the best neighbor out there. And that is what the Prophet has taught us. As far as the media goes, they, don't, they have a different perspective, you know, they all think of other terrorists. But when we do events like that, Alhamdulillah, it makes a big difference. And uh, thanks everybody for coming out. And uh, Jazakallah. Thank you guys for coming. This is the site of the future Ikna Brooklyn Community Center where they hope to have activities for youth, for the oldest, for our sisters especially as well. We want your involvement to help this uh, project go further. In years to come we don't want to see rocks on the floor but we want to see a basketball court, a room over there with a kitchen. <laughs> I'm thinking about food right now. <laughs> But yeah, we want to see this grow and sell into a beautiful center where we have these type of projects as well, serving the community. It needs to involve you, and we need to get more involved in our communities, wherever you guys are, inshallah. Um, with that said, subhanaka Allahumma wa bihamdik, ashadu wa la ilaha illa anta astaghfiruka wa atubu alayhi. Tuning in live from Brooklyn, 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 everybody and it's an essential part of being Muslim you need to be good to your neighbors it's a very important component of Islam one of the things that we're trying to do is also motivate inspire Muslims to get involved it's part of our faith we have some of our local guys here they went to different projects around here gave out postcards they actually went knocked on people's doors gave them the card you know letting them know a lot of people this has been their first time meeting Muslims or coming to the center seeing what it's all about it, you know, because it breaks a lot of these stereotypes that are out there. They come, they actually like, wow, I never met a person with a headscarf before, a Muslim. YouTube, YouTube, check me out. Okay, so we're going to have a volunteer meeting, inshallah. Yeah, do it now. All the volunteers come together. All my volunteers, come, come here. If you guys can all, all get, to get, get to this side. Thank you for coming out here. We ask Allah to accept all, your, all of our efforts from beginning till the end of this day. Amen. Every breath that we take, the bags that we give, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept it and multiply it so that He enters us into Jannah to the doors. Amin, amin. The persons who are going to be giving away the bags, and those are going to be majority of the sisters. Three sisters over here and then a few inside. There's going to be a sign-in sign -in person over there, well, I'll discuss later. But after the sign-in, they're going to come here, they're going to ask for a bag. You're gonna give them bags based on how many children they have. If they don't have any children with them, they get one bag. We want a very personal touch there. We want them to feel at home. So give them the bag, you know, and make them feel at home. There is some, um, I guess, uh, miscommunication with the Imam. Um, we just want to make things clear. You know, whatever goes around here, the pre-event speech, he just wanted to make sure what we're saying. He wasn't fully aware of what different processes are, so we tried to explain to him everything that's going on, who's going to do what. This is their community, they've been here for 20 years or so, so he wants to make sure that we do things properly. Initially I had scheduled maybe one, one more meeting before the event. This is, communication is important, you know? Very important. On behalf of Masjid Hamdullah and Ikna, Volunteers Belief, we want to thank everyone for coming out. We have a special program today that we're going to give out back to school supplies for our children. This is very important, right? Yes. I want to hear you. Yes! It's very, very important. <laughs> yes, it we is. Have, so all we want you to do when you come up here, we want you to just sign the, the book, sign your name, and uh, continue on, and you'll be all right. All right? Yeah. You hear me? Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Get the first bag. First bag. The first bag. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Hold the bag. Hold the bag. Hold the bag, Akeem. You gotta smile. 
Stay hard now. Represent. Thank you. Thank you. I know you guys don't want to stand in the rain, but we're probably going to have to stand mostly in the rain. I want you guys to thank them for coming, okay? When they come out, thank them for coming. And make sure there's no uh, obstruction over here. There's going to be people who are going to be trying to come from this way too. So we need to make sure and let them know that the line is all the way over there. Hey, those posters are expensive. <laughs> Why are they in the rain? <laughs> rain. Yeah. Rain is mercy. Yeah. Look at all these people out here in the rain. They're waiting in line to get basic school supplies. It's raining hard. I think the rain is doing my job for me, keeping <laughs> us people over there. <laughs> it's pretty raining pretty, pretty hard. Harder than I expected. My job to stand here and, you know, hold these down. So I'm going to end up flying away. Right. Woo! Am I taking wet pictures? Okay, I, think, remember. I think I want my buttons to stop working. <laughs> so what do you think? It feels good. Because we're fasting, we need this. Oh, yeah. As long as nobody intentionally drinks the water. <laughs> what? You know what's awesome? Right now they're having the rally down at Ground yeah. Zero. So over there, they're trying to make Muslims look bad. But look, over here, we're helping out the hey, community. Sorry. We need to go, go down traffic. Oh, do you need to talk to them? No, slow down traffic, so... Yo, y'all come to get back? Go to the corner, of course. We don't try to cross back here, go to the corner. Come back to teach the kids across the corner, not the middle. That's smart. Guys, this way. Just head down that way, straight to the back. You know, in the beginning, yesterday we were saying, okay, we won't put up a tent. Uh, and then the morning came, I was like, it's raining. So we had a discussion and we were like, should we do it, should we not do it? Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, we chose to have the tent. You know, at least have something to put what was the reason to not have the tent? Some people thought it was going to obstruct the whole, you know, walkway. Book bag, we're giving out book bags for the community. You know, I did. You know, uh, if you want to sign, young lady, if you want one, you can just come right over here and sign. Are ladies here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the way um, in the middle. In the middle. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Knock them out. Watch that. Right back to the floor. If somebody comes in a car uh -huh. uh, and we can just give it to them in the car so we can have them sign up so they don't have to carry out their car and you know, get all wet. That's a good idea. I like it. <laughs> I never thought about that. Just let me decide. Three. Yeah. Let me decide. Come on, honey. Come on over. No, 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 not them. In the car. In the car. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. Subhanallah. La ilaha illallah. Muhammad Rasulullah. Ramadan Mubarak to the world. Ramadan Kareem. One of y'all gonna have to come outside. Okay? Yeah, that's why I'm on in here. No, it's great. It's not funny. Hey you go. Better? You're welcome. We started off with plan to do seven, right. and now we're extending to ten. Wow. Some Muslims uh, organizations, they really liked it. They wanted to also have one at their location. So from 3,500 bags total, we're now extending to 4,000 school bags with super supplies. I'm the second in charge in the match here, and it's Alhamdulillah that Allah gave us the pleasure today, gave us the ability today to come and serve the community by giving out the um, book bags to the children. It's a beautiful day, Alhamdulillah. I thank Allah for allowing me to be Muslim. No, don't take my hat off, man. To be Muslim, no. La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, there's no God but Allah, and that the Prophet Muhammad is his last servant and messenger. I thank him for this day that he has given to us, even though it's raining, but it's suffice, but it's a blessing in the rain. Alhamdulillah. But more, 
majority of the stuff is all from donations from the you know the Muslim community. Yeah, yeah. Next year we need to really go out to corporate you know, corporations. <laughs> but this is huge because you last year was only one event. Exactly. Last and now year, you're right. at the ten. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It's amazing. And uh, uh, yeah, every after every event, the community is very positive, and they look forward to doing it next year, which is great. And that's what caused us like we need to do more, and we need to def continue it for the years to come. My weakness are children and of course they are my strength as well. Especially when they are going to school, I like to have them their school bags, school supplies. But at the same time, what about those who can even buy that stuff for their children? Their children are their weakness too and their children are their strength too. They need to get something so they can hand over to their children. They can see the smile on their children's face as I love to see my children smiling too. Family. I have the mom. And every year when I see him, I, I go, I give him back, back, back. This year, I see him, mashallah, alhamdulillah. It's all every year. Alhamdulillah, inshallah, inshallah. We're doing this as part of the Islamic Circle of North America, which is an organization in the New York area. We want to show that you know Muslims care for their neighbors, care for their community, and this is just a small effort that we're trying to pitch in and just do what we can. It doesn't matter what skin color you are, it doesn't matter how rich, how poor. And it's an essential part of being Muslim. You need to be good to your neighbors. It's a very important component of Islam. I would whole concept has always been to find a way to interact, always become a part of, always try to develop that and try to get to that point to where the whole Ummah worldwide begins to understand that the mission that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave to Muhammad the Prophet was that we are here to be the example for all of humankind because that's what he was and if we follow that I think our mission is easy. If building bridges to the community and stressing education are Islamic values, then we all have Islamic values. Stuff we can do like this to help kids, help the community, and then some of like these kids, you know, with these backpacks. Look at this. Thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. It's so beautiful to see a kid's face smile, especially the kids that are financially disadvantaged. It breaks a lot of these stereotypes that are out there. They come, they actually like, wow, I never met ex a person with a headscarf before a Muslim. One like, expectation I didn't see coming was that they touched my heart more, especially seeing that people are really grateful. I actually didn't think people were actually going to care. They were just going to take the book bags and leave. But people asked questions. They said, why are you doing this? And they honestly really cared that we cared. I think this was a great experience for everybody here and uh, you know I got to meet a lot of people from different cultures and you know interact with them they were really appreciative of what we did for them these people is what we need in this community we need nice loving people we don't need the hate that goes around I commend everyone within the Muslim community here who have reached out to the surrounding community to help people from all denominations. It, uh, they're not asking people, what's your race, what's your religion? If you're in need, we're all part of the same community. Uh, I commend them for it. It's a very beautiful day for you all and for us. And we thank you all for the help that you have given us here today. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you all and help you all in this life and the next life to come.